Good morning. Had a great sleep last night in the dunes here. I'm near Port Stewart, camped up high in the dunes, so it was very windy. But it was the only plate, it was the only reasonably flat spot that I could find in all of the dunes. I'll just walk up here a little bit so you can get a better view. But yeah, I had a really good sleep last night. Body is feeling sore and tired. My belly is just grumbling at me the whole time because it doesn't want to disappear. But I just keep going, right? You just keep walking. Get up every day, walk a little bit further, and soon enough, you'll be in County Cork. <laughs> this is the last time I'll see the ocean until I reach Cork, or at least be within touching distance of the ocean. So that's quite interesting. But yeah, that's the script this morning. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for hitting the like button on this video. That's how you can support my channel. Let's get going. Head good, body good, feet good, mind good, all good. Let's go. And if my true love she were gone I would surely find another To pluck my wild mountain thyme All around the blooming heather On my way into Coleraine here, come across this Garden of Remembrance. This really feels like a magical place. The amount of time and creativity that must have gone into this. If you've been watching my videos for some time, you'll know that I'm a big believer in fairies. That is to say, I believe that fairies are real what exactly fairies are is up for discussion i believe they are beings that they are spiritual presences that have always been here and that always will and that it's our duty to protect them in any way we can and most importantly not to disturb them so not to damage an area like this, not to disrupt a fairy fort, to cut down a fairy tree. I was walking down the main road as I came into Coleraine and I saw this winding path and a, a small sign saying, this way for the daffodil garden. So I've walked in here, not really knowing what I'm going to find, but... <laughs> There's a sign just here that says this was a medieval rat, a medieval fort, a homestead from back in the first millennium AD. That's a long time ago. This would have been built here for strategic reasons, defensively, because it's right at the very top of the hill. It looks out across the river Ban, which is behind the trees down there, and they can see for all around. So there would have been a family living here many centuries ago, and this surrounding land here would have been their farm. Today, it's been turned into a, a daffodil garden, a nice piece of escape for the people of Coleraine.
Hello. <laughs> This is downhill forest and it's really something. I just can't get over the, the trees. Like, look at this one here. This is a monster. Can you imagine how old this tree is? Look at all the ferns here. Just wall to wall green and the slopes around the side. It makes you feel like you're in an amphitheater. the kind of thing you just you can't put in a school book right you can't put in a course you can't teach someone it it's something you see and when your eyes are really open something you can maybe feel I will build my love a bower Here yon pure crystal fountain And on it I will pile All the flowers of the mountain Won't you go, lassie, go and we'll all go together to pluck wild mountain thyme all around the blooming heather. Oh, won't you go, lassie, go?